don't miss any content, don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. Hey guys, welcome back to Sahara Football. It's a fine Monday morning here. The Monday morning after Ghana beat Kenya 1-0 narrowly. A Caleb Kuban second half goal secured the win for the Black Stars. I'm going to talk to you about something that Mubarak Wakasu said. He said we need Kevin Prince Boateng for AFCON 2019. We're going to hear Kwesi Apia's explanation for leaving Kojo Asamoa out of this game. And also, the president of Ghana has admonished the Black Stars to go on and get victory in AFCON 2019. Do you think they can do it? Let me know your thoughts in the comments box. As usual, I'm your host, Selassie Fiaoi. If you are new to the channel, I advise you to subscribe to this channel and click on the notification bell to get more updates so let me just jump right into it we all know over the weekend the final qualifier games were played we now know all our 24 teams heading to afcon 2019 in egypt that will be in june the draw will be held on april 12th and mubarak wakaso is saying we need kevin prince Boateng to be in afcon 2019 squad i don't know what why he would make such a statement you know no kevin prince Boateng is in spain right now with barcelona and is barely getting playing time he's barely playing any matches for barcelona and i don't know why he would suggest kevin prince Boateng should be included in quesia ps final squad to make it to afcon 2019 i'll read the story to you right now the story says barcelona superstar kevin prince Boateng must be included in the ghana squad to help the black stars if they are to win the 2019 african cup of nations says spain based midfielder mubarak wakaso now the black stars secured top spot for the tournament in egypt on saturday when they defeated kenya 1-0 to finish top of the qualifying group despite winning the match against the harambee stars fans were unhappy about the display of the squad with many complaining about the depth and quality of the squad with Boateng's rich vein of form which resulted in barcelona snatching him in a shock transfer from italian club sassuolo during the winter window his compatriots who plays with him in the la liga believes the player will help the cause of ghana wakas who plays with spanish top flight side deportivo alaves thinks Boateng is a player of black stars the black stars need to break their title drought following their recent form we need him Boateng. he's the type of player we need to be honest for me he has to come we need such kind of players in the team we need his experience quality and determination wakasu told football made in ghana when asked about the barcelona player really we really need him i can't talk too much about it but we need him for the past two years he's been phenomenal and as we can see he's a different player he's back to his former self Boateng has not been called up by Ghana since the 2014 World Cup in Brazil because of disciplinary issues when he clashed with coach Kwesia Pia. He was expelled from the camp together with Sule Muntari and subsequently asked by the World Cup Commission to apologize to the entire country. Since Boateng has not done that and with coach Kwesia Pia still in charge, it will take a lot for the Barcelona star to be given the chance to return to the black stars so that is mubarak wakasu there advocating for kevin prince Boateng to be back in the black star squad i don't know why mubarak wakasu would say that but what do you guys think do you think kevin prince Boateng should make it to afcon 2019 he is barely playing for fc barcelona do you think he's still the player we had in 2014 and 2010 at the world cups let me know your thoughts in the comments box. I personally don't feel comfortable calling up Kevin Prince Boateng since he hasn't proved himself this season. Um, he had an injury with Sassuolo earlier and earlier on in the season and came back and helped them. But with FC Barcelona, he's struggling to get into the squad. And based on player selections for national teams, it's based mostly on form and how frequently the player plays irregularity actually is the only regular regular thing in the black star squad and it showed on saturday most of the players that were called up that 75 percent of the players called up have not been playing for their clubs regularly and it showed on the night they struggled to gel and i, I don't think calling kevin prince Martin will be the best that's my opinion let me know yours in the comments box and now to my next story and it's about the president of ghana nana Kufado. 
he has taxed the Black Stars players to win AFCON 2019. This is what the story says here. The Ghana president, Nana Adadwanko Akufuado, has lauded the Black Stars for achieving their first target of, of topping Group F in the 2019 African Cup of Nations qualifiers. This follows Saturday's difficult 1-0 win over Kenya at home thanks to a late strike from Caleb Ekuban. Now the head of state is now charging the national team to set sights on winning the ultimate in Egypt this June. This is what he said. Warm congratulations to the players, Coach Kwesiapia and his technical team and the management team of the senior national team, the Black Stars, on Saturday's victory over Kenya. A statement on his Instagram page read, now phase one of the project that is topping the AFCON qualifying group has been realized. Now on to phase two, which is winning the next African Cup of Nations in Egypt. I am confident we can make it if we work at it. God bless the Black Star. So that is the president of Ghana admonishing, tasking the players to make it to AFCON 2019 and to win the trophy and bring the trophy back home. We would so love that, wouldn't we? I really think it's possible, but from what I saw on Saturday, I'm having second thoughts. But hey, it's a tournament. Anything can happen. With hard work and determination, I think we can achieve a lot. To my next story, and it's about the Black Stars winning bonus of $10,000 for matches being played. It has been restored. Yes, their $10,000 bonus has been restored. The story says here, the Black Stars have had their $10,000 bonus per match restored. Head of the 2019 African Cup of Nations in Egypt this June. GhanaSoccerNet.com understands. Now, the Ghana president Anna Dudanko Akufado vetoed after a meeting with Skipper Samwajan and his deputy Andrea Yu at the Jubilee House. This is to motivate the players to win the tournament and end the country's wait for a continental title since 1982, where the fourth title was clinched in Libya. It could be recalled that the MPP government took a decision to slash the winning bonuses by 50% to five thousand us dollars during their campaign at the 2017 african nations cup in gabon now the news was delivered by then sports minister designate isaac isyama but this has now been reversed the five member black stars management committee head by former asante kotoko executive chairman and now G head of gmpc dr kk sapon will supervise the activities of the team from now till the tournament kicks off. Ghana are going to face the Harambe Stars on Saturday and won one nil to top the Group F. So the Black Stars bonus has been restored. They now have their $10,000 bonus as they always get instead of the $5,000 bonus. <laughs> What do you guys think about this? This there's, is a move to motivate the players to do well in the tournament. And I think it's actually going to help in a way. But I think, yes, it will help. But let's see how it goes. Let me know your thoughts about this in the comments box. Do you think it's a right move to restore the $10,000 bonus given to the players who are playing for their country, the Black Stars, ahead of the AFCON 2019? Do you think this is a right move by government? Let me know your thoughts. Now to my final story and it's about Kwesia Pia. Kwesia Pia has revealed why he left out Kojo Asamoah in the starting lineup. We all know we got the team sheet and Kojo Asamoah was not in there. And the story says here the Black Stars head coach Kwesia Pia has disclosed the reason why he benched Inter Milan midfielder Kojo Asamoah in Ghana's clash against Kenya. Many were expecting the experienced player to start but he was left on the bench in Ghana's last game of the 2019 African Cup of Nations qualifier. Speaking to the media after the game, Kwesi Apia stressed he chose continuity over changes, the reason for leaving the former Juventus player on the bench. Actually, he said, this is what he said, Actually, Kojo Asama was in my plans. As to whether he will start or sit on the bench, you know I have to make the final decision. For some time now, I have been using Lomo and I believe that he had to start so that's along the line i may bring kojo asamoah in i was looking i was looking at kojo in a way that i might use him at the back or use him in the midfield role so i decided to keep him on the bench 
for now so as the game went on i'll bring i'll think of whether to bring him on or not he noted the black stars however managed to win the game thanks to a late strike from debutant caleb ekuban who was celebrating his birthday on saturday as well so that has been it for today guys i've been bringing you updates on the black stars mubarak wakasu says kevin prince boating has to be in the final afcon squad wow this is strange let me know what you think in the comments box and kwesiapia has revealed why he did not start kojo asamwa and the black and the ghana president admonishing tasking the players to bring back the cup in july this year i'll see you guys in the next one enjoy your day